Hey guys, Lobby Designs here, and um, bringing out another video. And uh, this this time it's a Real Fly Demons video. So the next one in the order is Drag Force, and this is uh, actually one of the most helpful um, demons. I guess you'll 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 ever learn about stuff like that, uh, and it has many many uses. So basically, what you do is you just go here, get your uh, get your Drag Force. I have it on bounded at the moment um, because you, you 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 usually want to use it as uh, sorry with bounded um, unless you want all the particles in the scene to stop it, it'll be universal um, but but yeah so I I usually use it bounded um, but you can make some really cool effects with it so I do have a plane but it's just uh, it's it's, uh, it's out of view and I'll just simulate. Now it always does this with the first frame, but it's a bit quicker now. So you can see that as it goes into this box, it, it starts to slow down. And basically what it's doing is, it, it's, it's just putting a general uh, force on all the particles and slowing them down by 1.5. Not sure if that's like velocity or whatever, but it just generally slows them down. It doesn't... Uh, it doesn't drag them towards here. I'm pretty sure it doesn't. All it does is basically put a drag force from the opposite direction from where they're going. It just slows them down. So then that would mean that it comes from down here. So if I just put it on two, yeah. Actually, I'll leave it on four and simulate a bit more. It always does this with the, with the first frame simulation or whatever. So now we'll go back to this, and you can see that we're about to get a really, really cool effect. So on this one here, I've put the drag force onto, uh, onto negative, uh, negative 1.5. So that speeds it up again, and you can see that. Well, I I think that that just looks really cool. It 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 looks like, I guess octopus things and then they, then they see small clumps fall, falling down uh, but these strands here I know you can get that effect pretty I think you can get that with a tractor as well but I mean this is it's just a nice cool effect so maybe you could have like a camera animation just with this bit here and then something cool like that because they're just strings I don't know what you want to do but and that's just default liquid uh, so yeah so I mean that's just something uh, cool uh, I guess that I, that I noticed uh, that you can do um, but yeah, so that's just uh, that's just that. Uh, now there is also another option uh, with drag force. I'll put both of these onto shield mode, shield effect. Sorry, and then we'll see. Let me see what happens. Yeah, so I think what it is, is it affects the particles, because I'm, I'm only, uh, well, yeah, anyway, so I think what it's doing is, it's, it's acting like when the particles come into this cube, like there's a force, like a plane force under them, which pushes them all out, that's what I assume is going on, uh, could be wrong, but... I mean, yeah, it's just it's just trial and error and shit. And then we'll put inverse on. And we'll see what happens. Yep. So basically it's doing the opposite. It's I think the shield is coming from up top and it's propelling them, I guess, yeah. Um and yeah, so that's basically it. Um, there is also force limit, which is uh, say you want only want them to slow down to a certain, I think, speed. Uh, it's not that clear on that, um, but you can go to the vault and read that. Oh, actually, that's what I should be doing. But anyway, uh, you can change this to circle, uh, sphere. It's not much difference. Uh, you can change the attenuation. Actually, no idea what that means. Um, 
relation to the research that I guess, uh, and effect, effect vertex. Uh, so, bum, bada, bum, 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 bum. I'm pretty sure it's. Yeah, so I'm not really sure what that does. But, but yeah, as you can see, you can do some pretty cool things with it. Uh, my favorite is probably this one. Um, but yeah, as I said, cheers everyone. Uh, if you have watched it to the end, please remember to like, like the video. Don't subscribe if you're not going to watch my videos. I don't even care about subscribers. I just care about giving people the knowledge and shit like that. <laughs> um, but yeah, I do it for fun. And yeah, you'll probably be seeing a lot more of me. And, um, and yeah, I'm not sure who's disliking my videos. That's, I'm really taking that to heart. Alright. That's, uh, that's sad. I don't know if it's people who have a grudge or something, but I, I really don't know. I'm a, I'm a, I think I'm a nice guy. But yeah, anyway, so have fun. Uh, try this out. Maybe, maybe someone can mesh it. Uh, I might do a tutorial on meshing, even though I suck balls at it. I, I, just, I just can't, I just can't figure something, there's something about meshing and there's all, uh, it's just, it's, I find it pretty complicated. And anyway, yeah, so see ya, bye bye, and cheers.